Each night I have to put my son down. He's five now, but he won't go to sleep without me. Every single night I have to walk him to bed, read him a story, and kiss him goodnight. Each time I close the door, I pray he won't wake up. Don't get me wrong, I love him. I love him so much more than I ever would have thought possible before he was born. But when I saw him, when I held him, I fell in love. And I would do anything to protect him. Which is why I wish he wouldn't wake up. If he just slept, slept forever and ever, then he wouldn't have to see tomorrow, see the future. I've seen it, seen it in his dull eyes and in the corpses and in the blood in the streets. I know he will not survive. He will be destroyed, be ended, or become a monster. Because the zombie apocalypse has begun, it has begun in my town, my town of less than 3,000 people, and it won't end here. It will spread. It has already spread to the surrounding towns, to the nearest cities. While the world hasn't been hit yet, maybe the world doesn't know yet, it will. It will know so, so soon. But for now, it is here. And for now, I fear for my son. I fear for him and my wife and our daughter. Each night I stay awake in the living room, listening to the thumps and claws and screams outside. I sit with my gun and my baseball bat, cliché, I know. But I have nothing else. I didn't quite plan for the end of the world, sorry. Each night I fall asleep when the sun rises. It scares me when that happens. But I can't stay awake longer, and they don't move in the sun, thankfully. I'm not sure why. I don't know if they could burn like a vampire, or if they just can't move, or can't think. I just know they do not move in the sun, and that when I watch out the window as the sun starts creeping out, they all flee. Not that we go outside in the sun either. While safer, it's not perfect. Stepping into a shadow is taking your life into your own hands, and nobody wants to risk that one of them is brave, that they're trying to lure us out, and so we stay in the dark like them. I sleep all day, though I know my wife and daughter are awake. They sleep at night, afraid of the screams and the terror in the dark. My son sleeps with me, though. Though I put him to rest at night, shortly after dawn each day he awakes me, only to crawl into my arms and sleep beside me. How he is so tired I do not understand, but I will not question his love. I only fear for the women in my life, so afraid of everything they rarely even come downstairs. Sometimes I am afraid they are sick. Afraid of the screams in the dark are theirs, and that I will not know better. That I will wake up and see blood on them. I am afraid it will belong to my son. But they aren't, and they won't be, because I will protect us in the dark. As my body rots and my desire for their flesh grows stronger, I will lay my son into his grave each night, and we will survive.